Southwest and Cat Claw Drive. It's one of Abilene's hot spots with plenty of shopping and places to eat. Over the past 10 years, this area has really boomed, and so has the traffic. No, I avoid the area on Saturdays and during lunch. Here, you'll find drivers defensively dodging their way through several lanes of traffic to get to and from their destination. This is particularly hard this time of day. With more construction in the works, another strip mall, and a new apartment complex. Navigating these parts isn't expected to get any easier. Something definitely needs to be done about it, but I don't have the solution. I'm confident it's going to get worse. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a lot of bad turning areas. You know, people have to dart out just to get across the street. So what's the plan? We talked with the city of Abilene to find out what may be in store for the busy spot. James Condry with the Traffic and Transportation Administration explains there are two kinds of work that can happen. One is an operational change, adding lights or signs. Anything beyond that would be a broader scope project, like adding lanes and physically changing the roadway. Condry explains that kind of work must go through the Metropolitan Planning Organization. Drivers may be disappointed to learn the city has no changes on tap for Cat Claw and Southwest. Condry says the city constantly monitors traffic flow all over town and there simply isn't enough to invest major dollars into what essentially is a handful of congested hours. Currently the uh, roadway uh, capacity, it's not, it's not been exceeded, it's not uh, even being approached. Uh, the roadway has capacity for added traffic. Obviously as more traffic gets on, uh, it impacts an individual's own driving. Abilene police officer George Spindler says there actually aren't that many accidents at Southwest and Cat Claw, but acknowledges there's plenty of frustration. <laughs> Spindler says there is one move everyone can make to reduce some of the headache in this area. The best things that you may have to do is uh, take a right-hand turn out of a business uh, versus uh, crossing several lanes of traffic and taking a left-hand turn. That's right, taking a right and the couple extra minutes to loop around may actually save you some trouble and maybe even your sanity. Mari Cockrell, K Texas News.